Hey Psych2Goers, and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for supporting Psych2Go in what we do. Our mission is to help everyone learn more about mental health and psychology in a digestible way. Now, let's begin. With anxiety disorders affecting nearly 20% of adult Americans, it can feel like anxiety has become a part of our modern day lives, and it's just something we have to deal with. It can feel so good to go home and indulge in some well-deserved vices. We've all indulged in the all-so-satisfying feeling of planting ourselves on the couch, binge-watching our favorite Netflix show, and gorging on pizza. But as tempting as that sounds, is it really the best thing for you? Here are 8 everyday habits that may be stressing you out more than you realize. 1. Loafing around Your daily activeness has a direct effect on your mood. Regular exercise is important in maintaining your mental health because it reduces stress. According to the ADAA, even just 10 minutes of exercise a day can improve your sense of alertness and concentration. Exercise produces endorphins, which reduces stress levels. It helps to decrease tension, improve your sleep, and stabilizes your mood. 2. Skipping meals Are your eating habits irregular? Do you skip meals sometimes because you're too busy? Skipping meals or eating late can deplete you of the important nutrients that you need to feel energized. When you don't have enough to eat, your blood sugar levels take a dive, making you feel anxious, sluggish, and irritated. Eating your meals on a regular daily schedule helps to elevate your mood throughout the day and can even help ward off depression. 3. Eating junk food do you have a habit of heading to the drive-thru a little too often? In conjunction with eating regular meals, eating healthy foods is also important for your body and your mental health. A recent study found that diets high in fat increase nervousness and render antidepressant medications virtually ineffective. Every meal you eat has the opportunity to negatively or positively impact your overall health. 4. Coffee Addiction is making a cup of coffee part of your morning ritual? Caffeine stimulates your fight or flight response, mimicking the reactions to dangerous situations. This is what makes us feel alert and energized. But this also means we have to deal with the fight or flight symptoms, such as increased heart rate, sweaty palms, an upset stomach, and shaky hands. If you're easily prone to anxiety, having coffee could be problematic because drinking too much coffee can make your anxiety worse. 5. Scrolling through social media Do you have a habit of scrolling through Instagram or Facebook in your free time? Unfortunately, being on social media for prolonged periods of time can be harmful to your mental health in more ways than one. It leaves less time to be more present at work and getting tasks done at home. This can lead to regret and anxiety for not using your time more productively. When you're constantly exposed to social media, it can leave you playing an unhealthy game of comparison. You might have feelings of jealousy and upset over your own life because you think it doesn't compare well enough to the others on Instagram or Facebook. 6. Not getting enough sleep Are you worried you could be sleep deprived? 7 hours is the recommended amount of sleep to get at night. Anything less than that and you will feel the effects of sleep deprivation. This includes heightened stress levels, mood destabilization, poor cognitive functioning, and a lowered immune system. Sleep deprivation can also cause anticipatory anxiety, which is the anxiety you feel right before events like heading into work, having to speak publicly, or taking a test. 7. Spending too much time alone Connecting with others is an important aspect of our lives. Spending time with supportive friends and developing healthy, positive attachments can help to improve social functioning, increase happiness, and help alleviate symptoms of anxiety. Alone time is important for recharge and relaxation, but spending too much time all by yourself can stir up feelings of loneliness, disconnect, and sadness. 8. Listening to moody music the emotions and effect of the songs you listen to have direct effects on your current emotions. If you're already feeling anxious or sad, it's probably not in your best interest to play your breakup playlist on repeat. 
that sad tune will exasperate the sadness and anxiety you may already be feeling. Are there any other anxiety-inducing habits you can think of in your life? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up and share it with someone who might find it helpful too. The studies and references used are listed in the description below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more Psych2Go videos, and as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.